Welcome back to STG TV, everybody. It's your boy, Salute the General, here with Real Hills. Great check out Mayor Kingstown, man. Season 1, Episode 4. If you're interested in full-length reactions, make sure to check us out on Patreon. Link will be in the description. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, make sure to hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Leave us a little comment in the comment section. Talk your little junk, do whatever. Let us know what you thought about this episode. No spoilers, though. You know what I mean? Keep it spoiler-free. But, uh, man, with that said, let's get this money. Let's get it. Hit the lottery. Who? The prisoners. Oh, I feel man. like they about to be living life in there now. I know. That's why you get. <laughs> you see what he's doing. What is that? A candle or like? It's about the barbecue, man. Oh, uh, or some water. I'm about to cook that. That meth. Yes. Like coffee to me, bro. I don't know what little things are. Already clean. Scheming on something. Oh, already, look at that. Vikings vibe. <laughs> <laughs> Toby, they got some pretty good actors in this. Yeah. I mean, it, I, I, I don't know. I don't want to say no name and disrespect anybody, but not big name actors. I mean, Lil Finger. Yeah. Who else? The, the mayor. White boy, the mayor. Yeah. Uh, his mother is famous. The white lady? Yeah, like the old yeah, professor I I lady. Do, she, yeah, she, I seen her. Maybe, yeah, yeah, okay. Couple big joints yeah. back in the day. I don't know about recently, but... Yeah, other that might be three, it right yeah, there. That's probably it, bro. But the rest of them are good as well, too, mm -hmm. so far. <laughs> or I can't wait to uh, 50 Cent get some help like this on all his shows. Uh-huh. <laughs> should be a lot, lot better. Want to get some food in the food court? <laughs> Say, you're out of your mind. What? I, I, I can't be seen in public with you. Well, fuck you too. I gotta go. <laughs> Worked out. Mm hmm. You got a call from a Carlos? He wants to see you. So, when's he coming in? He doesn't want to meet at the office. What up? I'll take uh, him even that. And someone called from Peterford Trucking said you know what it was about. Uh, yeah, all right. Mattress warehouse. Word. It is impossible to overstate the impact of Jedediah Smith's discovery. Would someone else have found it? Yes. But would the results have been the same? Would the boundaries of this country be the same? Had he failed that winter? This was the dawn of America, the superpower. And the price was everyone and everything in her way. Every show want to have a fucking, you know, history <laughs> lesson. <on. laughs> I didn't like that one. It's obviously foreshadowing him, getting through everything and everyone in his way. Have you spoken to Kyle? Yeah. Did he tell you? Tell me what? Well, then you haven't spoken to him. Oh, yeah, I talk to him every day. Mom, what? Yeah. What? Oh, gee, what? the fuck did I do? She had a quick ass right. Tracy's pregnant. Great. You're so much like your father. That explains the left arm. It was a right. No. It definitely no, was no. right. That explains the heartbreak. <laughs> he always been a goon, huh? <laughs> he got slapped <laughs> for his brother being having a baby. We gotta talk, man. When can you come by? Wait, Let's just talk now. <laughs> we on motherfucking cell phones, man. Why you acting like it's your first day on the job? Look, buddy, there's a 
FBI van not 200 yards from you, satellite, listen to everything you fucking say. All right? What difference does it make if we're on the phone or not? What the fuck? I'm trying to help your bad ass out. Come on. <laughs> That's crazy, yo. <laughs> this motherfucker is the FBI, man. <laughs> more, no more than 200 yards from you. <laughs> what the fuck does it matter if we talking on the phone or not? It is crazy that I know somebody like they know the feds listen. Oh. Think I ain't got shit covered? Boys want some candy sent over. For what? Some mm. killing that cracker. You know I can't do that again. They made a deal. Let's start with something like more time in the yard or a TV in the lunchroom. <laughs> they really got that music just going in the background. This shit is dope. Uniforms are gonna ease up on everybody. I'm not gonna check the mail so well. I'm not gonna fist the ladies as good. I'm gonna pay for this shit, man. You and me both. How the fuck I'm gonna explain wait till next week to a motherfucker who don't give a fuck it is one. I told him to play because you asked. You, you asked me. You gotta make him understand, Bunny. Make him understand. You're gonna have to distance yourself from this shit. Distance? How the fuck I'm gonna do that? <laughs> I Bro, where is this based out at again? Don't give me the line. Move me to the top. Excuse me? I'm not asking. I'm telling you. Well, in that case, I'll be right there. Sorry, hon. He got called away. Can you come back tomorrow? Five. I'll come back then. Hey. You're really beautiful. Thank you. You look like trouble. I think that's the chick that whoever that dude was called at the end of the episode and told her to bring her ass to to the joint and she was like why he was like because i said so dude he be whipping that shit that that air suspension go out on his ass where is he who what do you fucking think in his office got they're the top of the list, Pete. <laughs> Damn. I don't even know what we want. I know how you asked. Everyone's pushing me. What's the beat? Everyone. Beef? Got their fucking head. The guy's not even a ground. A the fucking week. People trying to cash in on Pete, their you're fucking smart enough to know this is not how we move forward. Can't be last in line, brother. I don't take sides. This is what I know. You're outnumbered 10 to 1 inside, right? You need the guards more than anybody, so status quo is your loving friend. And just be the guy. Just be the guy that doesn't ask for anything. And then you'll be the only one that gets something. And don't tell me what to do. Come on. <laughs> Broke my fucking glass. window. <laughs> you bitch ass motherfucker. Down, they ain't fucking with him. Yeah. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but you don't want to. That's crazy. He gonna die. He gonna die for this act before the series. He gonna die for the show over. Or go to jail. Uh, I don't know, man. That's the only way he has to go out. Other than that, he's gonna uh, run around. You talking out. about... Just in the whole show. Yeah. By the time the show is over. Period. He's going to die. Yeah. Um, yeah, I could see that. Evening. Why does this nigga come Hey, don't you take offense to that. It's not you. I know it looks bad. Shit. When is that bear going to eat somebody, bro? <laughs> At some what point. episode? Hell yeah, he's gonna catch somebody. Well, no, it was a black doing? bear, oh. right? They say the black oh, bear thing is really like. Fuck, Mike. Yeah. Oh. We're gonna show up. What do you expect me to do? Send fucking smoke signals? There's no cell service out there. What are you doing? Hiding in the fucking trees like a Vietnam <laughs> bat, Mike? With the bear. <laughs> like him and that bear are cool as fuck. Oh, does it freak the bear out, or you didn't understand it? You know? I don't understand it. Worry, why you ain't put anything besides a bear out there? Troopers offered me a shield. Good vision. All right, go. 
They start me in the field office in Benton Harbor. No location yet? No? Okay. Fucking Kingstown's basically Beirut, so. I'll find a promotion. Well, what's the pay? I'm gonna roll with. <laughs> Seven. It looked like Ohio in the beginning. Yeah. Yeah. Kingstown goes with it. <laughs> Kingstown, Ohio. <laughs> yeah, sounds about right. Yeah, we, look, we got a lot of criminals, but there's only a few good ones. <laughs> like those people that move product from Japan are professionals. Man. It's like, look, what happened to Jimmy? That can happen anywhere, but out there, man, it's... there's a reason why that job is new. I think he's doing the total opposite of what his, his mom, mom said, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe he's doing some reverse psychology shit. And this opportunity comes, and uh, I'm just having a, I'm having a lot of trouble taking it. You know, Benton Harbor, it's like 10,000 people. And I don't know, I just, I don't, I don't think that this is it. I don't understand, did he say 10,000 people like that was a lot of people? Or a little people. I'm assuming it got to be a little people. There's no way their town is smaller than that. 10,000 people ain't a lot of people. That's not a lot of people. Man. That's like my a mile. <laughs> <laughs> my high school. <laughs> <laughs> okay, a couple of them. Maybe a college. 